So, ich habe Starlight Drive-In ähm, ein bisschen aufgepeppt, aufgeräumt habe ich hier. Ein paar Roboter habe ich hier hingesetzt. Nahrung. Alles, was es braucht zum Leben. Und ein bisschen Verteidigung. Gut. Es ist Zeit, Virgil zu finden. Nehme ich mal an. Was hältst du davon? Hm? Ja, du bist ganz wild darauf, oder? Wo ist Virgil? weit ab vom Schuss. Ein Händler hat mich hier drauf hingewiesen, auf einen Volt. Hm. Die Oberland Station habe ich noch überhaupt nicht gefunden, oder? Tja. Ich kann einen kleinen Umweg machen. Was? In diese Richtung. So. Hast du irgendwas gehört, Nick? Nee, ne? Was ist denn das hier? Hm. Okay. Ich mache einen kleinen Umweg. Ja, das kann ja was werden. Na, Radiation? Ah, es hält sich in Grenzen. Okay. Ich denke, in der leuchtenden See werde ich eine Menge Radiation abbekommen. Hm. Blockierst du mir jetzt den Weg hier? Oder was ist das? Nein, alles gut. Ich gehe mal einfach direkt.
Damn. Ich ja. glaube, das bekommt er nicht. Mein Super. Nick. Hm. Ich glaube, ich muss mal raus. Na, ja, dich nehme ich raus. Einen anderen rein. So, was haben wir denn hier? Tatsächlich ein Volt. Und du bist ein Händler? I got so many flavors of mayhem for sale. Hm? Hey. Better buy my big guns now, because you bet your ass your enemies will. <lacht> okay, du hast sure. eine gute Verkaufsstrategie. A, a part of every big purchase goes to planting little bitty trees that I'll blow up in your honor. <lacht> Ah, was für Leute. Ah. <lacht> ha. Huh. Wow. Du hast ja ein Zeug hier. Na. <lacht> Lass uns das mal. Bist du feindlich? Du bist nicht feindlich. Ja, ich hatte einen Händler getroffen, der mich hier drauf hingewiesen hat. Vault 81. Friendliest Vault in all the Commonwealth. Because here they don't shoot on sight. Ha. Das äh, will ich mal näher wissen. Okay. Got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? I'm just a traveler. I thought I'd take a look around. Is that so? And you expect me to believe that? Oh, Overseer. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am, some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. Mm -hmm. But I'm a fellow vault dweller. 
Can't you just let me in? All the more reason to help out a fellow vault then. I'm interested. What is it you need? Fusion cores. Three, to be exact. You get the fusion cores, we grant the access. I already have the fusion cores you need. Really? Well then, I suppose I should say, welcome. I'll be down to meet you at the entrance. Yeah. Ich lasse es mal hier. Komm her. Sure. Ask away. It's just uh, with everything that's happened with you and your, your family, it's a whole hell of a lot to process. I wanted to make sure you're holding up all right. Yeah. I'm all right. Huh. You're a tougher nut than I thought. Tougher than I was. Took me a long damn time to get a feel for this place. Thank goodness I found Diamond City. It's got its flaws, sure, but it beats the hell out of anywhere else in the Commonwealth. Of course, when I took up there back when, people were just as scared of the Institute as they are now. Maybe more. The massacre of the CPG was still pretty fresh in people's minds at that point. And folks were still losing sleep over the broken mask. Plenty of people assumed I was just a saboteur, moving in to melt down the reactor or poison the drinking water. But at the time, they couldn't exactly turn me away. Broken mask? This was long before I'd moved to town, but apparently some gentleman type shows up in Diamond City, heads down to Power Noodles. Ah. Guess he didn't like the food because he pulled his pistol and opened fire on the folks enjoying theirs. When security finally put enough holes in him to drop him, they say he was full of servos and sprockets. Just like yours truly. Seems he malfunctioned, went berserk. It was the first time people realized that synths had stopped looking like me and started looking like them. Considering what these folks went through, I felt real lucky they let me in the front gate at all. Der hatte keine viel Funktion. Das war ein Test, ob man synths dazu bringen kann, wahllos anzugreifen. Kontrollzwang. <sighs> Massacre of the CPG, what's that? The Commonwealth Provisional Government. Years back, a group of settlements tried to get together and form a coalition. Every settlement with even a hint of clout sent representatives to try and hash out an agreement. Only the Institute sent a representative of their own, a synth. The man killed every rep at the talks. The Commonwealth Provisional Government was over before it even got off the ground. I took up in town not long after. I was damn lucky they didn't just tell me to scram right then and there. Why'd they let you in? Because I'd rescued the mayor's daughter. Gal of about 15. Pride and joy of the mayor back then. A man by the name of Henry Roberts. The young Miss Roberts decided she'd run off with some caravan hand she'd, uh, <clears throat> known for an evening. Turns out the guy was part of a gang of kidnappers. I didn't even know who I was rescuing, just stumbled on a crying girl and four toughs. I took her home and the mayor dubbed me a hero, offered me a place in town. Lots of folks protested and said I was a spy, but he wouldn't have it. Okay, Taking good. up in the city was tricky at first, but I never tried to hide what I was, and people seemed to warm to that. You took down four guys by yourself? Well, I didn't have to. Back then, synths were even more of an unknown quantity than they are today. I told <laughs> I them I was rigged to explode and started going... <laughs> <laughs> Hardest part of that rescue was keeping from laughing as they climbed over each other to get away. <laughs> okay. Was it hard settling in? Well, they sure didn't make it easy. I started off doing the jobs no one else wanted. I got more banged up being Diamond City's handyman than I ever did living out in the ruins. But I guess folks never forgot I rescued the mayor's daughter, so they started coming to me when people went missing. Wife runs off with a new paramour and takes the rent money with her. Talk to the synth. 
An upset father decides moving him and the kids to good neighbor in the dead of night's not the worst damn idea since the bomb? Go get Nick. After a while, the jobs got so backed up, they didn't even ask me to do the handyman stuff anymore. Hell, I was so happy to do it, it was months before I started charging anyone. I never stopped being Nick the Synth, but it was Nick the Detective folks came to see. It was about then that things, uh, well, things finally started feeling normal. It took me a long time to realize that home is where you make it. And with some time and effort, this place can be home for you, too. That's a long story, but I hope it helps. Want to get moving? Der Mann, der du als warst. Der Mann, der Mensch vor dir. Er hat mir gefallen, wirklich. Come on, Wynn. My guys have been working doubles for weeks now. They need a break. Everyone's working hard right now, Cal. You think I don't know that? Just do the best with what you can. That's all I'm asking. Fine. I'll see what I can do. But you and I both know we can't keep going on like this. Sorry about that. As you'll soon see, we have a few maintenance projects underway. Gwen McNamara, Overseer. Welcome to Vault 81. Here, we pride ourselves on having maintained a successful vault over these past two centuries. We'd like to be completely self-sufficient. But there are certain resources we can't provide ourselves. I'm impressed you maintained a successful vault for so long. Thanks. I owe it to the overseers before me, but some here would disagree. A few believe opening the doors to the Commonwealth was a mistake. Aren't you curious about the Commonwealth and what it has to offer? Of course. But my duty is to these people and keeping them safe. We receive a few select traders often enough to stay well informed. That's why I like to use a give and take system. If outsiders are willing to help us, we're willing to help them. Speaking of, if you're ready, I can take those fusion cores from you. Of course. Here they are. Thank you. Dr. Penske will greatly appreciate these. Now, I have work to do. Ma'am, what about his, uh, friend here? I'll allow it. Security is already extra mindful as it is. If he's lived this long in the Commonwealth, I'm sure he's chosen his friends wisely. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. Don't go feeling all special because the Overseer lets you in here. You weren't the first, and certainly won't be the last. Hmm. Wow. Signs of radiation. Impressive. Hey, Ashes. What are you doing up here? Ashes, where are you going? We keep the vault safe. Damn it. I'm not hey, like this. Hey, The Commonwealth sounds so exciting and dangerous. True, a bisschen, a bisschen gefährlich, ja? Klein bisschen. I got two words on what I expect out of you. The best behavior. Oh yeah, mach du mal. Dr. Forsyth and Rachel have plenty of medical supplies to get you stocked up. Mhm. Danke. Ah, du bist überhaupt nicht creepy. <laughs> hey, mister, are you really from the Commonwealth? Yeah, why do you want to know? I never met anybody from the Commonwealth before. I thought maybe you might want someone to show you around. Just five caps. That's not necessary. I can find my own way around. Oh, you're no fun. 
Watch out for the maintenance, it never ends around here. But I need your help here. Ain't this something? Please, you haven't needed my help in years. So whatever it is, it can wait. Oh, so Aaron and I can just wait? You're gone more than you're here. Whatever happened to loving husband and father? Stop nagging at me, Alexis. Mess? Huh. Our Commonwealth guest, welcome to the depot. And pardon the clutter, I don't get much time to tidy up these days. I didn't even notice. Thanks for being polite. Let me know if there's something I can get for you. I've got a little bit of everything lying around here. When you're dealing with items that are all over 200 years old, work just accumulates like crazy. Some days it's all I can do to keep my head above water. But you probably don't want to hear about all that. Let me know if you want to take a look. I might be interested in buying or selling. Great. I have all sorts of odds and ends. Hmm. Was it this? Thousand. Huh. mal gespannt, wie ich das Geld zusammenkriege. Das werde ich nicht brauchen. Siebenhunderteinundvierzig. Okay, noch dreißig. Alles klar. Now, where did I put those screws? Will ich jetzt mehr hier mit? Nein, ich hab's einfach zu eilig. Bisschen Handel treiben, gut. Aber mehr? Nein, ich muss hier raus. Dir früher im Dunkeln begegnet in einer Straße. <lacht> Stay safe, sir. Yes, I will. You're that like common you traveler, aren't you? Yep. But Calvin's always looking for tools. I heard he'll pay caps if you got him. Mm -hmm. Another outsider. What they let you in for? <lacht> Just taking a look around. Is the overseer just letting anyone in these days? I'm a fellow vault dweller. I don't care where you're from. It's not here. Hmm. No session. Also, das 
always wondered what you'd look like as a robot. Not too shabby. <lacht> Dankeschön. Ähm, ich werde mir das Gerät mal angucken müssen, eben genauer, bevor ich weitermache auf meinem Weg. Hm. Ich dachte, ich hätte was gehört. Hm. Und von hier aus... Hier aus kann ich ganz gut runterlaufen. Das heißt, ich werde zuerst einmal zurück. Okay. Shut down. No. No. Okay. Hey, I'm all. Hmm. Was ist das? Und auf geht's.